Yeah. yeah. Well, I have so much hair. I need to get a haircut. I'm going to turn it off. And we are starting, we're playing Wild Losing Rams versus the Canton Warriors home, and the tip off is off. Wild Losing will get the tip. And right off the bat there, Grady Cobb for the Rams gets a three. It's nice to have my commentating partner Aiden back. It's been yeah, a rough I, couple of games. I've myself. been out for a while now, haven't I? And a good thing Warriors answer right back with a nice left hand layup by Caden Williams. You're gonna hear a lot of a lot of clapping tonight, the Wild Losing bench, they've always done that. It's just something they do to get try to get in their opponent's head. They're a very well coached team. They like to slow the game down on both ends, defensively and offensively, so I definitely would expect a low scoring game here tonight. Bennett open three. No good. Nice rebound there down low by Moss. Tip it out. Milne, short corner. And there's another two for the Rams. Looks like the Rams will be in man to man defense here, and there's the clapping. Very good defensive team. They're very well coached. Kitchen over to Janone. Gets a screen from Williams. Nothing there. Williams almost lost the handle, gets it back, Nimzik up top, wanted to shoot, nothing there. Gets inside, mid-range pull up, and he gets the shooter's bounce. First two up on the board for Nimzik. Both teams coming into this game with a good winning record. Both are hoping at a home playoff game. So I believe the Warriors come in tonight as six and five record. And Moss inside for the two there on a nice pass from Grady Cobb. Janone tried to hit Mimzik down low, but it's poked free, and Burke will push for the Rams. Cobb another three, and he gets the bank. Not the prettiest shot, but it counts. Nimzik gets inside, down to Williams, lost the handle. That'll go to the Wild Losing Rams. Weston Bowles will come in the game for Tyler Janone. Rams are out to an early 10-4 lead. Coming up on five and a half minutes left to go in the first quarter. Cobb another three. Maybe a foul, no foul called. Kitchen with the long rebound. Bellows in the corner. Down low, Williams. Nothing there. Kitchen, corner three. Just short. Burke with the rebound and the push up ahead. Moss looks to finish, and it just rolls out. Offensive rebound, Rams. Good head fake there from Grady Cobb. Hand off Burke inside. And back up top. And the Rams will look to set something up. Cobb, a little mid-range, short. Another rebound for Kitchen. Fellows in the corner, nothing there. Back out to Kitchen. And they'll set it up for the Warriors. Nimzik for three, and it's good. Nimzik off to a good shooting start, two for two. Looks like the Warriors are going to play a little man themselves. Sorry if I'm stealing your lines, Aiden. <laughs> no, it, it's all right. Isaiah Way will go to the scorer's table for the Rams. Nothing opening up here for the Warriors. Williams down low, head fake. 
Nimzik offensive rebound down there, hounded by three Rams, and he'll draw the foul. Warriors will be taking the ball out of bounds. Bellows, three, no good. Strong rebound there by Way, and Burke will push. Gets inside, good block there by Peyton Williams. This will be a big man game as Wailushing and Cannon both have two very large men that can shoot threes, shoot inside and out all over the court. They tried to get it to Bellows there, lost the handle, but gets it back. Yeah, I do expect to see a lot of man-to-man -man from both teams as Weston Bellows gets in and draws another foul. Weston will be shooting two at the line. First one is no good. Brendan Matthews coming the game for Cameron Bellows. The second one is up and is good. I will bring the score up to Warriors 8. Why losing 10, coming up on three minutes left to go in the first quarter of play. Rams look like they're moving the ball around a lot faster than they normally would. They do have good ball movement. Every game I've seen them play, they play, they have wonderful ball movement. They seem to be moving at a little faster pace than what I've seen myself, so maybe we're in for a different kind of game here than expected. Moss in the corner, way for three, just off. That's what he can do, though. Isaiah Way is a very good shooter from mid-range and three, and he loves to get inside. Him and Cobb are excellent shooters for the Rams. Warriors being patient here, waiting for something to open up. Kitchen wanted to shoot it. Good defense there by Bennett. And there's a turnover steal by Way all alone. And there's another two. And Coach Kitchen will take a timeout. And Connor Faust will come in the game for Cooper Kitchen. Both teams have come into the game with big momentum as a high scoring game a decent scoring game I guess with two minutes left in the first quarter why was she winning 12 to 8 Y Losing won the first matchup between these two teams over NY Losing, and it was a fairly low scoring game. I don't think either team cracked 50. Actually, I think Y Losing had exactly 50 points. I think it was 50 to 34, so that's what they can do. They can hold teams to 30, 40 points, and they'll get whatever amount of points they need on offense to push them ahead to a win. Nimzik wanted to shoot, nothing gets inside. Good defense there by Isaiah Way, but Isaiah Nimzik. Proves he is the more valiant Isaiah and gets inside for another two. Warriors are definitely off to a better start over here than they did over there as Isaiah Way converts on a nice little mid range jumper. Faust with the ball for the Warriors over to Nimzik. Rams playing some very good defense here. Warriors screens seem to not be doing anything. Nimzik pull up three, just off, and that'll stay with the Warriors. Uh, 42, 42, 42. 
Kim will take the ball out of bounds. Kimzik up top. Weston over to Connor. Just about a minute left to go in the first quarter while losing up four, 14 to 10. Almost a back court there. Williams with the screen. Weston, mid-range pull-up just off. Ball up in the air. Big rebound there by Mitchell Burke. That's where he helps the Rams a lot on the offensive and defensive boards. And oh my gosh. Isaiah. <laughs> that was Mimzik. That was something right there. Isaiah with a huge block down on the ends of the boards right there. What is that? As his third or second block, probably yeah, probably the, his second and third block right here in the first quarter. That was that was ferocious. Cobb three, no good. Rebound Williams. That is something the Rams do a lot. Is that little dribble handoff up top? It confuses teams. It's really easy to get confused and lose your man up top there. But good defense there by the Warriors. Good hands by. Cameron, Warriors get it back. 15 seconds to go, Warriors will hold for the last shot. Let's see what they can get. Again, great defense here by the Rams. Five seconds, Matthews, three, blocked by Cameron. And what a defensive possession right there by the Rams to end the first quarter with your score. Why losing Rams 14, Canton Warriors 10. Both teams playing very, very well in the first quarter. So, do you, Reese, do you think this will be a high-scoring game or a low-scoring game, and vice versa, as what we have seen in the first quarter? Well, at this point, it looks like it's heading towards more of a high-scoring game. I honestly didn't expect this. While this coming out in a faster pace than they have normally, and the Warriors seem to be keeping up as that's where the Warriors are pretty effective is in fast-paced games. And uh, Warriors have been playing man-to-man -man a lot the last couple games, and they've been doing very, very well in it, as I've been seeing. I definitely do feel like the man-to-man, -man, the switch to uh, prominent man-to-man -man defense for the Warriors is helping them a lot on the defensive end. I feel like when they were playing zone, they were just too, too passive, and now with playing man-to-man, -man, it kind of forces them to be aggressive on the defensive end, and I think it's working for them. This Cobb will provide some on-ball pressure there, but inbound to Campbell's MLS as we start our second quarter of action. Janone looks to get inside. Good, tough spin move. Shot up. Tough shot by senior Tyler Janone right there to bring the Warriors within two. As I've said many times before, Janone is having an amazing senior season for the Warriors, as I believe that is number four, Blake Morningstar, I believe, who's checked in for the Rams. Way down low, drop step. Good defense by Isaiah Nemzik, but better offense by Isaiah Way. Kitchen gets a screen from Morse. Pull up three. Bang! Nothing but net for Cooper Kitchen as he connects on his first three of the night. Uh, maybe wanted to shoot. Ooh, a little razzle dazzle there. That was something. Morningstar kick out to Cameron, and Kitchen tried to draw the charge, but it is a blocking foul. <clears throat> Another thing I've noticed for the Warriors in previous games, they, in some games, they've ended the first quarter with nine, ten team fouls in one quarter, only having one team foul through. Almost 10 minutes of play is very good, and it'll help them. Three, 
Hunter Moss will check in for Bennett. Kitchen, Janone, good head fake there, deep two. Just off, Nimzik with the board, gets inside, gets his own rebound and up and in. That's a matchup that's probably gonna be a very good matchup to pay attention to tonight is Isaiah Nimzik and Isaiah Way down low and out on the perimeter. <clears throat> Moss inside, out, Morningstar, baseline, pull up, just off. That was a pretty good shot right there. Morningstar has a lot of height on pretty much everybody out of here. So it was a really good shot. He just couldn't get it to go. Lost it, out to Nimzik, double team down low. Tough mid-range shot, just off, rebound. Kashawn Cameron up ahead, Grady Cobb. And pretty, oh, just missed it. Right there, that was a good move to evade the defense of Kitchen, Cooper Kitchen, but Grady Cobb could not finish, and back down to the other end goes the Warriors. Fellows, they should get inside. Nice pass down low to Gavin Morse. And that will give the Warriors the their first, first lead, lead of the game. game. Yes, sir. I took your line, Aiden. I'm sorry. No, no, it's, it's, it's fine. Get really into this. It's, it's, it's exciting to be back, you know. It's exciting to have you back. I just get by myself. I get into it. But, oh, deep three by Hunter Moss. I just I get into it by myself. And I look over and tell somebody something. There's nobody there. Nimzik tried to answer back with a three of his own, just short. Rebound to Cobb. Ball stripped there by Kitchen, I believe. And the Warriors will slow it down. 4.20 left to go in the first half. Rams are up 21-19. Kitchen wanted to shoot it. Three up, just off. Good hustle there by Janone to save it. Bellows out to Kitchen, and the Warriors will set it up. Janone will set the screen for Kitchen. Great pass down low. What a head fake and an amazing pass by Cooper Kitchen down low to Janone to tie the game up at 21. Cobb for three. Just off. Big rebound there by Isaiah Nemzik. And the Warriors will push. They have numbers. Janone for three. No good. Rebound Cameron, and he's up ahead. Grady Cobb almost threw that put back down. He tried to dunk it, yeah. That would, that would have that been pretty close. impressive. He has the hops for it, though, too. Cobb, not the biggest guy. Probably, I'd say probably 5'10", 5'11". But he definitely got some hops there. Yeah, he can dunk pretty high. Like, it's not... Cobb played amazing last year for the Rams as a sophomore. He was the target, I guess you could say, for many defenses in the NTL. Try to lock him down. Moss wanted to shoot at nothing there. Morningstar over to Nolan Oswald. Moss for three. Good defense by Connor Faust. 
and Burke with the rebound. A nice little hop step there to get inside. Mitchell Burke, a great senior leader for Wyalusing. He does a lot of the dirty work down low on the boards. That's where he get a, gets a majority of his points as well. Janone wanted to shoot it, nothing there. Bellows up top, closing in on two minutes. Janone for three, just off. And the Rams are out running again. Moss, and tough finish. Hunter Moss with an amazing finish there to get another two for the Rams and one more at the line coming. Moss first shot is up and it's an I mean there's only he's only There'll be a foul on number four for the Wiley Sheen Rams on the on that foul shot and it'll be Warriors ball out of bounds. It's like Nimzik checked back in for the Warriors. I believe three subs came in for the Rams. Great low high give there. Williams tried to get it up. Good block there by Isaiah Way. Bellows back to Faust. Good mid-range pull up by Faust. No good. Tough fight down there. Good rebound by Oswald. Way up ahead to Cobb. Maybe wanted to get it to the cutting Oswald there. And Cobb gets inside. Almost effortlessly there. A little breakdown by the Warriors. By losing Rams on a 0-6 run right now. Gets knocked out of bounds by the Rams home BU Warriors ball underneath their own basket. You know, Matthews in the corner, looks to drive baseline. And the ball stolen by Bennett. That's one thing you do not want to do against this Rams defense is turn the ball over. They are very efficient in turning turnovers into points. Is right there. Cobb gets inside. Just rolled out. I don't know how that honestly rolled out. That was it's just one of them rolls. And here come the Warriors. A minute left in the first half. Rams up 27-21. Good pass down low. Nimzik. A good block there by. Good block there by Oswald. Cooper Kitchen will come in the game for Cameron Bellows. See what the Warriors do here. Just over 40 seconds left to go in the first half. Quick ball movement there. Cooper Kitchen open three. Bang! As Kitchen brings this back to a one possession game. Cooper has been shooting amazing from three-pointers this year and has been helping the Warriors a lot. Yep, him with and them. Janone have been shooting very well from three-point land. Way for three. Just off offensive rebound Bennett. And the Rams will hold for one. Burke up top, guarded by Williams. Ten seconds left to go. Gets inside. Good hands there. Burke on the floor, good hustle. Jump ball, three seconds left to go. That will stay here with the Rams. Let's see what the Rams draw up here for a last second play. Burke gets the two to end the half. Well drawn up play there. And your halftime score is 29-24 in favor of the visiting Wailusing Rams. Holy smokes, that ha that's halftime? That's halftime already. That, that went fast. That did go pretty fast. There's only seven fouls. Jeez. 
usually there's a lot between oh, both teams. But a chance here. I'd just like to thank the sponsors who have provided funding for these broadcasts. Welch Insurance, First Citizens Community Bank, Lepley Engelman, Yaw, and Wilk Law Office, The Dunn Group, Flavorland, and Warrior Wash. Also thanks going out to the sponsors of our Circle W Sports Athletic page, Cuz Excavating, and Blaze Alexander Nissan. Thank you. So, Aiden, what do you think about that? What do you think about that first half for the Warriors? They they played extremely well, I thought, they compared did. did than they did in the first game. But they they also they haven't came out of Maine, and I think Wiley team's been struggling with that a lot on the offense. Yeah, the first matchup, the Warriors played a lot of zone, and with the Rams' quick ball movement, they were able to get a lot of open threes from Cobb and from Isaiah Way finding holes in the zone. And I do think this man-to-man -man switch is going to help the Warriors a lot, and I think that's why it's a lot closer game than it was the first go-around. And it's the Warriors' home court. They play pretty well here at home. <clears throat> well, I guess that'll do it for our short little halftime show. <laughs> we'll be back in eight and a half minutes.
It'll be a Warrior Ball to start the second half of action here with the Rams up five. 29 to 24. Bellows inside, left hand no good. Williams with the cleanup crew. I don't expect much to change offensively for both teams. Everything seems to be working. And Hunter Moss is on his game tonight. I believe that's his third three-pointer. He is shooting very well from that three-point. I think he's, what, three for four or three, three for, for five? I think, yep. He's a guy who's he's really improved as compared to last year. And he... You know, looks to get inside. Tough shot. Little congestion here. Got a mismatch down low with Nimzik on Moss. Let's see if the Warriors try to find that. Janone down low. Williams guarded by Burke inside. And he draws a foul. Williams will be shooting two. First one is up, and it is no good. That nasty. Second one is up, and it is good. I will bring the Warriors back within five. And that is why Lucy's weave that they run very well. That's what can happen off that little weave action right there as Abram Bennett had a wide open lane. Eventually people get caught up in it and can't get to their person and that's that's what happens. It gets a lane. Bellows for three and it's good. Bennett inside out to Milne, Burke. And here comes the weave again. Moss looks to get inside. Bennett, Cobb for three. No good. Big rebound there by Kitchen, and he'll draw the foul. Play that will be on Mitchell Burke. Never mind, that is on. Who was that on? That was on Milne, I believe. Warriors trail by four here, five and a half left to go in the third quarter. Kitchen up top, good pump fake gets inside. No good, tipped out to the Warriors. Williams, foul, and he'll be at the line for two more. That is Cobb's second foul. First one is up and is no good. Second's no good. It looks like it'll be a f there will be a foul on Tyler Janone for a push. By the way, will get the ball. Out of bounds. Kayton's still into man to man as of right now. Bennett, Moss, Cobb looks to get inside. Lost the handle a little bit. Back out to Bennett. Cobb open three. And it's good. Corner pocket. He shoots very well. He does shoot very well. He's got a nice form. And he's. Grady Cobb is very good at creating his own shot. That's what he does best. Get out, get out, get out, get out. 
two screens there from Nimzik. Nimzik, Kitchen, or Williams. Not Kitchen, as Caden Williams hits the short little jumper there for another two. While those teams weave, they will. And get a lane, and that will be knocked out of bounds by the Warriors. Looks like Kent will finally go to zone for the first time tonight. Change up. Give Wild Loosing a little look, see how they react. It is harder to run that weave against the zone, so I don't see them running that. Cobb gets inside. Tough rebound, Mitchell Burke. And up for another two. Seven point game, 39 to 32, Wild Loosing. That's the story of the game so far for Wild Loosing. That's what's hurting the Warriors is. Burke on the boards and Hunter Moss and Grady Cobb shooting the three. Bellows down low, nothing there. Up with the left, blocked by Cobb. That'll be a foul on Cameron Bellows. And Brendan Matthews will come in the game for Cameron Bellows. That'll be two on Cameron. Wilson Bellows will come in the game for TJ. Weston Bellows will be on Cobb. Isaiah Way, deep two, and it's good. Nimzik on the wing, looks to get inside. Little bump from Way. Cobb with another steal. Burke down low. No foul. Nimzik with the board, and he'll slow it down. Good decision there. Matthews for three. No good. Follows his own shot. Ball on the floor. Jump ball. That'll go to the Rams. Connor Faust will come in the game for Isaiah. Give and go there. Burke to Way, and he'll be at the line shooting too. Looks like Keaton has a guard set besides that one big Caden Williams on the floor. First one is up and it is a good. That'll push the Wailusing lead up to 10. With two minutes and 43 seconds left. Second is up and it's good. Score within 11. Kitchen up top, deep three, and just rolls out. It almost got that lucky bounce back. Almost got the shooter's touch there. And Sean Cameron will come in, Hunter Moss out, and Oops. timeout called by the Warriors, 30-second timeout. has been a, a weak point for the Warriors coming out of halftime. They've 
struggled in the third quarter. Cooper Kitchen will be shooting two at the line for the Warriors. First hook up and is good. That will bring the score within 10. Second one's up and is good. Score within 9 now. Looks like Canton is playing full court man to man. See how they'll handle it and down low, Isaiah Way. Right that. That's good. Wylusing back up by 11. And Matthews hits a little 10 foot jumper there. Cobb comes right down the floor and gets inside. Up for Cobb and he's good. Isaiah Nimzik comes in the game for Weston Bellows and four will come in for number one for Y Lucy. Second one is up and is good. Score within 11 out for the Warriors. Faust over to Williams, inside Nimzik. Maybe Way might have got a piece of that right there. Huge third quarter outbreak here by the Rams. And Blake Morningstar, three, will put the Rams up 14. And there's a foul on Bennett. Already, I guess going against what I said earlier, as I expected a low-scoring game, and right here in the third quarter, we all already have about about what the score was in the last matchup. So both teams are playing very well. Tough finish there by Nimzik. Just story Let's see the, the Warriors night. can get a stop here. Sorry to interrupt you. It's all right. I'm it's sorry. all right. I interrupt you all night. Story of the game here is. Story of the game here is just what you'd expect from this by losing team. They play good offense and good defense. There's some good defense right there by Caden Williams. And there's a foul on Isaiah Way. His second, I believe. Let's see if the Warriors can bring this in within 10 before the end of the third quarter. 41.8 seconds left. left. Yeah, here left. Yeah. This was, I believe, a six point game at the half. And the Rams have doubled that. A little confusion there by Campbellos. Got stuck, nothing to do. Let's see what the Rams do. They'll most likely hold it for the last shot. Good pinch there by Nimzik. Way, eight seconds, looks to get inside. Nothing there. Cobb, step back. Three, no good. And that'll roll in to the end of the quarter. After three quarters of play, while losing 50, Canton Warriors 38. That was a good defense for the Warriors at the end of the, of the third to hold. I losing Rams to get no points. 
huge outbreak there, scoring wise, coming out of the half for Wailusing, and that gives them a very sizable lead as compared to what it's been all game. This is the largest lead of the, lead of the game. 12 stayed within that four to six range, but they came out of the half ready to play and scored a lot of buckets very quickly. Let's see how the Warriors react in the fourth quarter. Going to have to really put something together against this tough defense that they've seen here tonight. I'm tired too, man. There to start a quarter travel on the Warriors. Cameron over to Moss. Hand off to Isaiah Way. Looks to get inside. Good defense there by the Canton Biggs. Morning star for three. No good. Big rebound there by Kitchen. He evades the oncoming trap. Nimzik up top. Looks to get inside. Shots up. Just off. And that will be... Looks like it was tipped out by Isaiah Way, but that will go to the Rams. Or is playing a little zone press here. See if they can't create a turnover. Moss in the corner for three. Long. Good rebound there by Cameron. Shots up no good. On the floor. Jump ball. That'll stay with the Rams. Cobb to inbound. Morningstar in the corner. Cameron hand off to Moss. Here comes this little weave again. Moss loses the handle. Ball on the floor. And Campbells will push. Janone, corner three. No good. Still a 12-point lead here, about a minute and a half into the fourth quarter. Good ball fake there by Cobb. Nemzik went for the steal and gets called for the foul. Abram Bennett on deck for the Rams. Called. Let's see what this is. This might be interesting. Bennett inside. Kick out to Cobb. Just off. Morning start with the board. And the Rams are killing the Warriors here on the glass. First one's up and it is good. Second is up, and it's no good. Rebound. Valusi extends the lead to 13. Warriors hopefully can get something off this possession on offense. Bring it within. Great defense there by Burke. 
Williams wanted to get it to Nimzik, but nothing there. And there's a block foul, blocking foul on Grady Cobb. That'll be his third, I believe. Warriors are going to have to string something together here if they want to come back from this 13-point deficit. Cameron at the line, shooting one and one. First one's up, and it's no good. Warriors have been having foul shot troubles almost all year, I would say. Yeah, it's been it's been one of their weak points. Kitty Williams with a block on the defense. Burke up top to Way. Hand off Burke. Morning Star puts it on the floor. Isaiah Way for three, way off. And Nimzik, nothing you can do about it there. Just not expecting the ball to go where it went, and that'll stay down here with my loosing. Oh, my eyes hurt. Yeah, I feel you. Way gets inside for the finish. That'll put the Rams up 15. His second half has been all wide loose and Warriors really struggling. As the Warriors will be shooting a one and one. First shot is up and good by Keenan. Both shots up and good for Caden. That'll bring the Warriors back within 13. They're going to really need a big run here. A nice pass there by Mitchell Burke inside. That'll push the lead back up to 15. It's just it's really tough. The Warriors, they love to score in transition. And with this while losing defense, it's just hard to do that. Good post move there by Caden Williams to get another two. Bring him back within 13 again. Burke blows by Kitchen Bennett in the corner. Up top, Morningstar. By Lucy, he's going to look to waste as much of the clock as they can here. Big rebound there by Matthews. And the Warriors will push. Kitchen gets inside, kick out, bellows, Nimzik, spin move, and a block on Morningstar, I believe. Three, four, block, two. Timeout, White. Coach Kitchen will take a full timeout. While losing up 55 to 42 with four minutes left in the fourth. We should, might be a little late in the year, but we should get a petition going for like a halftime show. Like maybe we can get like Katy Perry in here and sing Roar. That'd be nice. What do you think up there, Hunter? I'm sure it's doable. We can get somebody in here. Well, why not be Katy Perry? When I watch the live streams, I would hear you talking to Hunter and then Hunter would be like, mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> in the background. I'm just the camera. If you become more, Hunter, you could, we could switch or something. You know that, right? Okay. Four minutes left to go in the final quarter. Nimzik will be at the line shooting two shots. Two shots. First one is off. 
and it is no good. Warriors have seen a lot of those tonight. The toilet bowl rolls, the multiple bounces. They're just there's a little little cap on the rim as Nimzik there he gets the roll on that one. As the Warriors really need to push the pace here on offense and defense, and Grady Cobb is just doing a wonderful job breaking the press. And I can definitely say whoever does come out on top of this game will definitely earn it. It's been a tough fought game. Just the that Rams has. coming out of half with that big, big run. momentum. Big moment. Looks there'll be a foul on the floor. And it'll be a one and one because the Warriors have eight fouls. And that'll be third on Brendan Matthews. First one's up. And it's good. So he'll be shooting another one. Second is good. Definitely more fouls in the second half as compared to the first half. First half, I believe we only saw tough finish. That was a tough finish right there by Isaiah Nimzik. First half, I believe there was only seven fouls combined by both teams, and here we're sitting with a big 17 as Isaiah Way gets inside. The Warriors are there. They're pushing it, but the Rams are not giving up. Kitchen. Foul on the floor. That'll be a one and one. He's out of control. Faust and Bellows on deck for the Warriors. This will be two shots here. Not a one and one. First shot's up and good by Kitchen. Cam Bellows and Faust in. Matthews and Janone out. Kitchen hits both free throws. The Warriors will stay on this full court man to man. Isaiah Wade, good hands there by Cooper Kitchen. 3.15 left to go in the final quarter of play. Score within 12. Warriors have been playing very much better here as Hunter Moss finds a wide open layup. Warriors have been playing better in the fourth quarter. On both sides of the ball, it's just by loosing with that big third quarter and they're not giving up here in the fourth as Williams misses that shot. Lead is back up to 14 for the Rams. Way puts the ball on the floor. Spin move up, blocked by Nimzik. That'll stay a green ball. How many blocks do you think Isaiah has tonight. I don't know, between Isaiah and Caden, they've probably got a combined like eight blocks, I'd guess. They're playing good defense down low. Cobb, three. That'll be a travel. <laughs> Notice why Lucing's coach saying there not to turn the ball over. The Rams really do not turn the ball over a lot. And as I say that, the Warriors with another turnover. The Rams really do not turn the ball over a lot. And that's part of the reason they're a very successful team for the past couple of years. They just do not turn the ball over. And that's one of the keys to getting a lot of wins is you cannot turn the ball over, play good offensively and defensively, you're going to get wins. And the Rams definitely have all three of those boxes checked as they're going to look to waste as much as the clock away as they can. Up, thir up 14. Burke inside. Cobb. Faust will push. Up ahead, Nimzik. And a foul there on Mitchell Burke. That'll be his third. Definitely going to need something Tyler special Dunone here. will come in the game for Cooper Kitchen, I believe. And Brandon Matthews will come for Cambridge. 
Brooks for Cameron Bellows. Nims the kids both free throws. And as you see here, while Lucing playing with that mentality, no lead is safe as Grady Cobb shakes his defender. Warriors are going to need big stops here. Poked free by Nimzik. Matthews with the rebound. Janone, deep three. Just off. Good rebound there by Cobb. Rams will take a 30 second timeout. See what happens here in the final minute 20. Warriors down 12. Cobb with the ball gets inside. He'll be shooting one and one. Whoa. I don't know what just happened. I, I have no idea. <laughs> Whoa. First one for Cobb. Cobb is up and it's good. Second is good at it also. Looks like Warriors are trying to push here to save time to get more extra points. Coop will be at the line for two. First one's up and it's good. The ring, the score with in 13. Second. Up. Is a miss. Rebounded by Isaiah Way. Closing in on a minute left to go in the fourth quarter. Good block there by Caden Williams. And another foul. This one's up and it's good. It's Coach Key's not very happy with Grady Cobb there. And Kitchen brings the Warrior deficit up to 11. The Rams have, there's a turnover right there. Still got time. That's the thing, every second in basketball is valuable. 47 seconds is a lot of time. Warriors got to move fast here. Might need a couple threes. Kitchen. And that's the guy you want shooting threes right there. Cooper Kitchen. That'll bring the Warriors back with an eight. And steal there. Blocking foul. Tough right there. Tough break for the Warriors. That'll put Isaiah Way on the line shooting two shots as both teams now are in the double bonus. Good 
first one's up and it's good. Second is good also. As Abram Bennett is not letting Cooper Kitchen see the light of day, and that's definitely what you want to do. Nimzik wanted to shoot it, nothing there. Pull up, no good. And that might seal it right there for the Rams. Good run there by the Warriors. And that'll do it. Brother Sing win. win 65 to 55. The Good Warriors game. will fall to 6-6. Six and six. And that's what happens when you run into a very good wide losing team. They've, ever since Coach Keyes has came in, they, he's taken a subpar, mediocre program into a very good contending team, as you saw here tonight. And Both we're looking teams. to continue what they did last year, going into the second round of states before facing a an un, almost unbeatable team in Mass Civics and Science, which is school down in Philly. But they're definitely showing that they're here to play. Both teams came in very comfortable with running plays and everything, and while losing just shut down Canton pretty much in the second half until the fourth quarter when Canton started picking up pace again. Good defensive effort there, especially in the third quarter by the Rams. And six, once again, 65-55 is your final score. And I'll be back in like 10 minutes for some JV play.
What? What? Yeah. I don't know. The only reason why I did that was because I was falling backwards. It was either going to be that or you were going to see a travel. Anybody Still using this one? Was that on? Yes, it was on. Oh! Yeah, it was. <laughs> Blackwell over to Palmer. Morse inside, can't quite finish. That'll stay with the Warriors. I know that feeling pretty well. Do you need this? I will soon. I don't know where you're from. Rockwell inbound down low to Morse. Off again, got bodies on the floor. More struggling, and that'll go off to the Rams. What? You think I'm trying to do that? Yeah, I'm trying to do Good pressure there by the Warriors, and Palmer loses it. Ball on the floor. Back to the Rams. 13 with the ball. Corner three. Number. Number whose number is that? Number eleven. Number eleven missed that shot. Morse, good pump fake, pull up. Perfect shot. Oh, Morse with the steal. Breakaway layup. And one by Gavin Morse. It wasn't actually a one, but it was a really nice layup. First bucket of the day. He's probably sitting at 650 with his outstanding performance tonight. Yeah. I'm sitting at four more than when I started. <laughs> I think JV's going to be a very good game tonight. Where did Cooper go? I don't know. He's put top. Oh, he's doing How much is Brady have? I'm not sure. 45. It's like Kevin Fleming's oh. out there rocking the headband. New look. Aiden is wearing a headband. You just can't see it because his hair is down to his shoulders. Passes to 11. Gavin with a D, though. Fleming with the defense. Number 20 is dribbling around, trying to set up his offense. The drive by number 11, and it is no good. But Weston Bell did not get the rebound like I thought he would because he hit goes off with rebounds. Just like you and every game. It's crazy how many boards he gets. Very strong and talented kid. He has a lot of potential. It's like the zone. Oh, number 13. And as I say that, Dang it, Lisa jinxed us. I jinxed Fleming you. brings the ball up, passes out to Morse. Morse with the. Oh, it was a good look, but not good enough. But that's alright. Hey. I got it. 11 in the corner for the Rams. 20 up top. He's going to shoot that. And just off. Nice, you almost had more blocks than I had points. It's high though. I'm, I'm gonna get Warriors are up 4-2 here. And Rockwell will bring the ball up for Canton. Oh, 11 with the steal. Breakaway dunk. Oh, I thought he was about to boom that. He sure did look like he was going to dunk that. I thought he was going to. Slung the man. Not very often you see a dunk in JV. <laughs> good follow, Morse. That was a good follow to get Canton the ball back. Palmer with the three, and it's good. Aiden Palmer's probably glad he's back after missing a couple games.
you know, me and Yep, Aiden Palmer well. missed a couple of weeks due to I quarantine. Shoot, and if that doesn't work, I pass. <laughs> oh. Weston Bellows with his 60th rebound. Whoa! Oh. Holy cow, oh, folks! Block. <laughs> Number 11 just <laughs> broke our backboard. I don't know if you just oh saw that, but God. there's a crack up there. Weston Bellows with his 15th rebound of the night. We like to call that a sheesh. Oh my Step back. God. No good. Weston Bellows with the rebound. Kick out to Kevin. Oh. Mm. There. What was it called there? Foul on the floor. Uh, foul on the floor. Mushka, Mickey Mouse. <laughs> with the inbound. Rockwell. Swing it. To Fleming. To Palmer. To Palmer. For the three. That's no good. Off the right, right side of the iron. Number one, coast to coast. And Bellows in. <laughs> I don't want to go over there. Nobody fun is over there. Are you, are you staying over here? Yeah, move down. <laughs> you ever feel like you're you ever feel like talking to us now? Tough luck there for the Rams as ball hits off the inbounder and that'll go back to it. Rockwell bringing it up. Late in the charge by the Warriors. Fleming. Drives in. Pinched off. Oh. Trying to get it to Palmer. Miscommunication there. Back to Morse. That was a very good block. Morse on the drive. That's comes been out. happening all night, both games. Unfortunately, yeah. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. Good crossover. Shot there. Bang. As Stephen A. Smith would say. Bang. Number 11 here is showing he's a pretty good player. Bug Smith with the drive. Bug oh, Smith I'm almost good. with the end one. Water break. Come on, Bug. Turn me up, Bug. Turn up. Brackman and Rao in for the Warriors. Sub in for the Rams. Brackman and Rao in for the Warriors. Warriors with the inbound. Lance Rout. Lance Rout. Kevin Fleming. Kevin Fleming. Trying to get it over Gavin. Rips. Fleming. Oh. Good job, Kevin. That's no good by Kevin. Yeah, I was pulling the trigger tonight. The 1-3. One 1-3. Three, one three, I dribbled number yeah, one for drive. three. I was like, nah, Long. I'm Weston Bowles right. with the rebound. I pulled from the logo. No push. Looks to go coast hey! to coast. Gets inside. Hey. Good finish there. By West Turn Bell, me up, Wessie. Can up nine to seven. Were you screaming at me when I pulled in? You're like, wow, it's wide open. Well, I was like, hey, we needed a quick bucket. You didn't notice we were down by 20. Oh, I got you. Oswald on the wing. Oh, Oswald on the wing. Feeling lucky. Back with the board. Well, you had a better chance of me that night. <laughs> Weston with the drive. Kicks it out to Kevin. Back to Wessie. Wessie feeling ballsy. <laughs> you can't say that. <laughs> you can't say that. <laughs> Got an injured injured ram. Player. Oh no no no. <laughs> Number 11's been cooking, man. He can't get hurt. He's cooking, cooking with gas. Number 11, he is. Not peanut oil. He is very good. Hopefully, he gets back into the game soon. My Lucy Mason, he's popping off. I don't know his name, but I want to know his name. So I can get a hold of Coach K at Duke. Talking about number 11 again. Just like you. Oh, this sounds like a Oh! Nice heads up play there by Weston, but then a not so heads up play to grab it. It evens out. <laughs> Warriors will press a little. 
Rams break the pass. Press. I'm sensing a long hair theme. We've seen that a lot. You mean the flow? The flow. <laughs> the flow gang. A couple of teams have had the flow going on. You ever thought about being a ref, Isaiah? Because that was perfect for him. What? Me and Cooper used to be referees. Oh, I did one of those games. Yep. That was fun. 20 bucks a game. It was good money. Bank. Good money. Big bank. You do 10 of those games? Yeah, $200. That's 200 That's 200 That's 200 on you. <laughs> 30 seconds left to go in the first quarter. Warriors still Weston, up 9-7. Oh, my. God. Back one with a shot. Oh, that happened to me once. Don't feel bad, Lance. That happened to me once, too, and I gave up one of my rebounds. Because I'm trying. <laughs> that hurts. No. I didn't know eating at a concession stand violated COVID-19 regularly. It's because everybody will be gathering out there in groups, and there's no way you're going to tell people to wait in a single file okay. line. Mask on. What are everyone up there doing? Sitting together? Yeah, all 20 of them. Yeah. Oh, intercepted. Zone Hawk. It intercepts you. One second. Oh, Wes with a shot. Oh, no good. Come on, Wes. Come on. And I would like to introduce the big man who works down. I, I don't know what I want to say here. Caden Williams. Oh, boy, here we go. The strongest kid on the team. This Did you dye your hair? Yeah. I told him to. Can you guys move down a little bit? Well, that cord, this cord only goes. Well, this cord only switch. Shut up. Oh, what is happening? I'm stuck. I'm trapped. You're stuck like I'm trapped. Second quarter action. Looks like we got Krishan Cameron in the game for the Rams. Looks like it's a foul on five. Morning Star into Cameron. Good to see number 11 back there in the game. Morning Star with a three. That'll put the Rams up by one, ten to nine. Number eleven will push. Morning Star wanted to shoot it. Cameron in the corner. Up, no good. Good rebound there by Weston Bellows. Good board, Bellows. Ashton Rock will bring it up for the Warriors. Caden Williams bring it up for the Warriors. <laughs> Fleming back out to Morse. Oh. I, I was writing. Ew. Travel on the Warriors. I'm bopping. Cameron into number 11. Over to Morningstar. Rams swinging the ball around up top. Afternoon star with a pass. Great pass there by Morningstar. Down low to Cameron. Three for 
for more. Hold the trigger, Dad. Warriors will press a little here. Not a huge problem for the Rams. Morningstar down low. Off of Morningstar on Warriors ball. Palmer off the screen, down low to Weston, ball tipped away. Rams again, good ball movement here. 23 shot up, no good. Weston for his 19th rebound. <laughs> Weston's known for those rebounds. Another rebound there for number 11. Yeah. 13 drives baseline. A little bit of a high pass there, but 11 corrals it. Shot by 13. Rebounded by Weston Bowes. I am really tired. Weston with drive, saves it before going out of bounds and shot by Austin Palmer. It's good. Come on, Boom. That's my commentating, buddy. It's right up, right there. Come on. I gotta go plug this in. My phone's about to croak. Blocked by Weston Bowes. We have found number five, Ashton Rockwell. Almost a full group substitution for the Rams. Warriors bring on three subs of their own. Two, three subs, maybe. Warriors will stay in this 2-3. Good save by 23, Mason Schultz. Oh, It'll be a blocking foul on the Warriors. Number five, Ashton Rockwell, and that'll be his third. <laughs> Ooh. Early foul trouble for Bug. <laughs> Runner by number 20 is no good. Rebounded by number 35, Braden Broman. It's out of bounds. Rams ball. Number 20 maybe wanted to shoot it over to 11. Ball being swung around up top inside Oswald. Good floater there by number two, Nolan Oswald. Rams are now up 14 to 11 with two minutes left to go in the first half. Good pass by Gavin Morris to Brandon Roman. 35 with the rebound. Back out to Morris. Morris with a shot. Now I'm jumping by Nolan Oswald. It's no good. Two subs on deck for while losing.
<laughs> Good pass yeah. inside. Mason Schultz with a bucket. Great find right there. Good bounce pass by Lance Rowe. Yeah, barely even hit the net. There's a confusion now at the Warriors because of travel. Looks like number 13, Aiden Palmer, is back in for the Warriors. down at the pool. All right, hey, listen, hear me out. You get a Warrior training show. No. All right, can't train yet. Just under a minute left to go in the second quarter. Rebound by number 23, Mason Schultz. Number 34, Hunter Brackman is coming in for the Warriors. I'm pretty sure it does. All right, Reed, thanks. Oh, you're 20. welcome. I know you're part of me. Warriors raw. Well. That's stupid. And then the drinking water made you get good. Good defense here by the Rams. Causes a Warrior timeout. 16 seconds left to go in the first half. While losing 17, Warriors 15. It's gonna be over July, July. <laughs> I'm just like it. I know you are. I'm just trying to tell you. America's a disgrace, man. All these other countries, they've already gone. A bunch of people have had it. The people can hear me talk about. <laughs> the U.S. is a disgrace, man. Okay. All these people just not wearing their masks. That's all you got to do. Mason Schultz with a three. No good. But it's Warriors ball. I think so. Four seconds left. Oh. Uh, Miscommunication there. You know, Rams ball. Say there's, say there's like monkey bars around the red thing. You get, you don't get a call on the red. One good shot, but it It's no good. The end of the second half. Score is 17 for the Rams and 15 for the Warriors. Bam, bam, bam. What? Do, 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 do. Again with the one on one with the number one ranked player in the state and Isaiah Nimzik. <laughs> Are we watching the the one v one of the century? Yep. Isaiah with a pump fake, trying to get Carter off his feet. Carter never leaves his feet when he tries. All right. Good around at the three point arc, driving in. Oh, not this. 
still dribbling around some more. <laughs> Takes a three point, it and it's no good. Route gets the rebound. Cook it up, boy. Dribbles it out. To get that red flashing light to go away. Between the legs, Hezzy to the lane. Oh. Almost an and one, Isaiah but there's no wraps here. Three point arc. I taking a deep three. And he wakes up. <laughs> Carter gets the ball. Oh, pushing the pace a little bit. Goes in oh, for the reverse. Off his feet. Oh. Oh. Almost gets rebound, him. Takes it back out. Taking another three. Falling <laughs> down in is good. <laughs> Falling for the end one. Bouncing it off of Rout's head. Oh, oh. Rout gets handsy. Oh. And it's almost good. Take your route. Carter gets it. Pushes the pace. Oh. oh. Up and oh. under. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Can't get it. Is that with another three? Wake up. <laughs> <laughs> Rout has the ball. Drives in. And gets the contact. Hey! hey. That's why he's number one player in the state right there. <laughs> Checks it up. Between the legs. Oh, pump fake. Pulls the three. <laughs> Doesn't hit anything. I think about the ball again, dribbling around the three point arc. One foot. Jump shot is good. <laughs> Isaiah from the black line. And it's good. What he said? Talk some trash to Route. He gets the ball back. Trying to go out with the steal. Yes, sir. Oh, can't <laughs> get it. <laughs> Post <Both> face. <Hey. laughs> <laughs> I think it's a rebound. Route drives in. Jalei. Oh. oh, almost gets the steal. <laughs> that is shooting it from deep. Oh. And breaking it. Go, Carter, go. Carter with a 17th miss layup. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Isaiah's still talking trash. That is so sweet. Oh no. <laughs> From half court. Oh my god. Carter just walks off the floor. <laughs> All right. You going down? I'm out. That was Cooper Kitchen, folks. Oh, he's coming back. Oh, he's back. <laughs> <laughs> he's back for another challenge. Kraut is back for more. He's pulling from his range.
Guarded with the ball. Crossover. Between the legs. Sizing up. Oh. Spin move. <laughs> oh, he falls. Breaks his own ankles. You want it? <laughs> you want it? <laughs> Second half action here underway. It'll be Warrior Ball to start. Passing it off to Palmer. Looking for the roll, can't find it. Getting taken from him. Cutting Fleming going for the. That's a foul. Speed with ball, 99. <laughs> One out of two there from the line. Hunter Brackman bringing the ball up for the Warriors, passing it over to Kevin Fleming. <laughs> Trying to get the offense started, passing it to Weston Bellows. He gets a screen from Mason Schultz, taking it all the way off to the bottom of the backboard. Jump shot by Gavin Morris. Mason Schultz with the rebound. Probably how it feels when you guys pass it into me and I break my feet later tonight. Oh, yeah. Thirteen inside, back out to number eleven. Yeah, Puts the ball down. Weston Bell is twenty seventh rebound. With the pass ahead to Gavin Morris. We have an under move. Hey, get aboard. Ouch. Just under five and a half to go in the third quarter by loosening up one. Okay, shot by number 11. Rebound by Weston Bellows. Passing again up to Gavin Morris. Gavin Morris with a stop and shot that doesn't connect. Hunter Brackman saving it. Hey, D up, D up. Right. Hey, good hands, good hands. Oh, 
Schultz for deep two, no good. Losing, swing the ball around here, number 20. Three by number 20. Connected this one. Rebound by number 13, Aiden Palmer. Kick ball on my losing. It's can't ball. Pass inside. Weston Bell is taking the shot. No good. Rebound by number 23. I'm listen. Shot up and good by Morse. Levin puts the ball on the floor. Number 11, my bad. That's a nice take.
with the offensive rebound and put back. The pick and roll by hey, uh, block, 34 and 13. Hey, don't reach, Blake. Hunter Brackman throws up the three, but he can't connect. Thank you. 
seem to have no trouble with it. 22 with a long three. You can't connect West Virginia with both. Warriors trying to get some screening action. Get off the track. by Ashton Rockwell, who gets pushed. Good defense by the Warriors. Huh? I'm tired. I'm about to fall asleep. Yeah, I want to drive it in. Set up. 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 Set up
those screen rolls for that ball. That's good. And the lead back up to 30. Hey, get 31 Warriors, 28 Rams. Timeout taken by the Rams. There's three minutes left in the fourth quarter. Trying to get it inside the 13. ourselves a tie ball game.
pressure that the Rams are bringing. Knocked away. Warriors taking another timeout. That's it. And Warriors going to try and deal with the pressure. Passing it in to number three. Back to Weston Bellows. Over the Mr. Walker back to Weston Bellows. Over the last route. They need to get across. And they get it across. Over the Weston Bellows. No. Stolen by Blake Morningstar. He brings it up the court. Charge taken by Weston Bellows. That's a big play right there by Wes. Some pretty darn good ball movement right there. I do agree with you there, Reese. It's been a very exciting game. Weston shoots the first, misses. Yeah. 
Weston misses the first shot. Weston Bell shoots the second. Misses that one as well. Blake Morning starts to go to the left side For the brother Anderson can't make the score. 38 for the Warriors and 34 for the Rams. Pleasure commentating alongside you for the game, Caden, as long, even though I didn't talk too much. Yeah, you kind of slept there on the side, but yeah, that's I okay. Fell asleep. I took over for the night. Yeah, that's good. Well, it was a pleasure being here with you, Reese. Due to some... No. Schedule's a mess this year. I, mean, I you're believe me. there isn't a, another home game for another week and a half, I believe. We're going to be all over the place. But we'll be back soon enough in Warrior Country. Yeah! <laughs>